Hi there, my name is Matt Cole, co-producer of their Sexperts podcast, along with my great friend Brian Garrity. Before I begin, I just want to give a huge thanks to our guest on this episode, Alex Weller. This is Alex's second time on the Sexperts, and we're very glad to have her back. If you'd like to see her perform live and you're in the Norfolk, Virginia area, then come see her and her short-form improv team down the street at the Improv Riot, hosted by me, Matt Cole, at the Bush Comedy Theater on July 27th at 10 p.m. It's going to get kind of dirty. If you want to see a cleaner version, there is a show right before that at 8 p.m., featuring the group Barnyard Ambitions. Without further ado, everything you're about to hear is made up on the spot, so please enjoy this next sex episode of... The Sex Bay! Turn on your computer. Dial up the web. Dial up the web. Intro music, intro music, intro music, and hi there! Welcome to The Sexperts. I'm your host, Dr. John T. Alanese, CPM. That's Certified Professional Midwife. Oh, that's right. I'm uh, Delilah Haydare. Yeah. And I am uh, of Delilah's podcast closed captioning. <laughs> <laughs> That's so useful because we have a podcast now. Are you offering your services to this podcast for free or no? I got to make a living, <laughs> but uh, I will cut us a family discount. <laughs> yeah, I uh, listen to podcasts. Yeah. I translate them into okay. uh, sign language. And then I post YouTube videos of just me <laughs> signing the podcast. So See, that if is you, not what I thought was good. I thought you just transcribed it and then typed it out. No, if you're deaf and you haven't enjoyed like Mark Maron's WTF yeah. or Pod Save America, now you can through Delilah's podcast transcription services. <laughs> podcast closed captioning. <laughs> so, <laughs> but it's sign language. It's not closed. Ca- isn't closed captioning like I, typed I messed out up? Words? On a, no, closed captioning is when there's a little caption down there. Yeah. <laughs> So, but, wait. Okay, I didn't name it right. <laughs> okay, whatever, whatever. We're way off track already. Listen. Podcast, what would you call it? Signing. <laughs> yes. But, that, want- but the people are going to picture signs hanging on a podcast. <laughs> We're still working a name out, but yeah. you get what we're doing for people. We're changing I, I lives. It. Yeah. And well, broadcast, we're broadening podcast audiences one deaf person at a time. You know who's also changing lives? The Sexperts. Because we actually reach out uh, to members of the sexual community. And grab them. We grab them. Willingly. Willingly, with their consent, and take them into the fold. We tell them exactly what they need to know Here about is sex. What you're, here's how you're sexing wrong. And here's how you're going to... Here's s- how you're sexing right. And here's... And here's how you're going to sex all <laughs> freaking <Good> night. night. <laughs> oh! Tagline! <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> um... <laughs> And I forgot to mention, every week we come to you live from uh, a different location, uh, and today we're outside uh, The Wave, The Wave Dance Club. We Man, can't get inside, though. There's a foam <laughs> catastrophe. <laughs> they had a foam party earlier but in the listen, evening. But listen, I got a theory. Yeah. What is foam? A lot of bubbles. What do bubbles do? They pop. We're going to wait this out. <laughs> what is foam? Baby, b- b- pop me. Right, whatever. Anyways, we're the sex birds. We're not the song birds. So uh, let's get to our topic of the day, which well, is... No, a- no, neither are we the foam spurts. <laughs> although you might think of it by listening to me talk. Oh, God, I ate Taco Bell last night. I got the foam spurts out of my dick hole. All right, listen. Uh, topic uh, of the day. Top- if you have foam spurts out of your dick hole, I don't think that you should be blaming the Taco Bell. <laughs> I think you should be blaming that your bathroom centric life, love life. No, yeah, I fucked somebody in the Taco Bell bathroom last night. <laughs> so, so foam spurts on that. Listen, <laughs> topic of the day. The topic of the day is a very interesting one because, um, as you know, I'm I'm fairly young myself. Uh, so, um, you're, you're, we'll say this: you're young for a certified professional midwife. Yes, you're like the Doogie Hauser of certified. <laughs> The certified professional midwives. I'm wondering when they're going to let us into the wave. Anyways, uh, our topic of the day, uh, if you remember, um, in the early days of the internet, uh, you used... Uh, ding, 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 ding. Yes. Yep. Dial-up modems, AOL. I did a lot of, I did a lot of cyber sexing okay, back then. But now, Slowly. what happens, AOL is gone. I don't have AOL anymore, and I don't think it's a company anymore. So today's topic of the day is post-AOL cyber sexing. Post-AOL cyber sexing. Timely. <laughs> yeah. Well, people out there are like, how do I cyber sexing? And, <laughs> and we get a lot of phone calls about yeah, this. This is going to be a tough one to, uh, to sign. Um, well, let's uh, go ahead and... Oh, somebody's actually walking out of the wave right now. Oh, it's Ooh. our guest. Hi, welcome. Hello. <laughs> Hi there. Hi. 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 Hi.
there. Why don't you introduce yourself to our audience, please? I'm Tony, the finger from The Shining. <laughs> <laughs> Red rum. <laughs> Well, welcome, Tony. I'm glad you survived the foam. Thanks. Um, here, let me wipe a little bit of foam off your nail there. Yeah, I got it ingrown right now. Tony, sorry. I um, I didn't recognize you at first. You, you've aged a little bit. We all can't stay young. Well, she's pruned from being in all the... He's pruned from being in all the uh, foam. Oh, yeah. How is it in there? Wet. <laughs> Wet rum. Wet rum. <laughs> Tony, thank you so much. Um, we don't usually get uh, actors uh, on on the, the program. We've had a couple. We've had a couple, yeah. Um, but what have you been up to since The we Shining? We the brother I've, of the fish. I've only seen you in The Shining. What else have you been in? Uh, I've been pitching for other shows, but <laughs> shows. Uh, fingers just aren't very popular right now. <laughs> They're so- looking for thumbs <laughs> in this day and age for texting. Oh, that makes sense. It sucks. Oh. So how do you uh, supplement your, your income? I mean, do you do commercial work? Uh, or? I appeared at a couple uh, comic cons. <laughs> oh, you... I also advertised for Captain Morgan Spiced Rum. <laughs> how do you do that? Red Rum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, you just walked oh, into that. Oh, Jesus. I did not see that one coming. I really did not see that one coming, and I feel so awful. Yeah. You're ashamed to all the certified professional midwives. Um, Tony, I don't, I don't want to probably bring up any, anything, um, you know, emotional, but w- what about, uh, the other fingers? Are they your, your brothers, your sisters, your family? Where are they? So when The Shining finished recording or filming, how, however you kids call it, uh, they, they, they only needed me, yeah. you know, so they kind of just cut them off. Oh. And they saved me that he just, he's missing, you know, just me actually. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I, I, I remember that. I saw your true Hollywood, your e true Hollywood story. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, you really battled back from your addictions. Yeah. Talk to us about your addiction days. I was really into stamps for a while. <laughs> I just love the feeling of someone licking my face <laughs> and, and sticking the stamp on. Oh my god! And then you went through that doorbell phase. Oh, uh, don't bring it up. I'm still in the stages of recovery. <laughs> yeah, you got arrested for that ding ding dong ditching, didn't you? A couple times. Oh. The Norfolk Police Department is not very happy with me. What was your What was your rock bottom? Ha, or have you hit it yet? They say it's like waves, you know. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you don't actually hit hit bottom, bottom, bottom. You hit bottom out. a couple times. Oh. You come back up, and I I think I'm on the upslope. There There was a doorbell at the wave, and I didn't ring it. I know that. I know as a finger, you've you found your way into the private parts of many of. <laughs> Hollywood's elite. I just want to bring up, I was the finger of like a four-year-old. So Wait, is that like a pedophilia? Yeah, but then you aged. I, yeah, I aged, but I have that four-year-old soul. Oh, you know? okay. I see. I mean, I see. like, I kind of started to, they had to preserve me. I didn't, like, I aged mentally, but physically I'm the finger of a four-year-old. Oh, that's true. I guess fingers don't grow once they're cut off the hand. That's like, a, <laughs> that's like an ancient Chinese saying. <laughs> Oh, oh, uh, speaking of ancient Chinese sayings, I want to get to our topic of the day, and I want to hear your perspective on this, Tony. I'm looking at you, bud. Um, Post-AOL cyber sexing, because sometimes, um, you know, we wait, have the wait. internet, we have the Hold ability. What? You, are you looking for work right now? Uh, yeah, actually, uh, Tidewater Comic Con was a couple months ago. Uh, yeah, I opened up a new business where we uh, <laughs> do sign language. <laughs> what? For podcasts. Oh, wait a minute. I can do one sign. And <laughs> what is that sign? The one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I walked into that one too. But I think a celebrity a celebrity guest who just does one letter, one number, mm-hmm. could be the marketing that we need to get our idea off the ground. You are so fucking Would you come right. to work for us? Uh, I'd, I'd love to. I have my resume with me, actually. Oh, let's take a look at Let that. Let me pull it out of my knuckle. <laughs> wow, you got a little... <laughs> Oh, there you go. Oh, it's very tiny. You need some reading glasses, Delilah. It's covered in foam. Let me this off here. I don't think everybody's getting out of there alive. Oh, jeez. Red rum. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead and read the resume out loud, Delilah. Well, uh, went to Stanford. Stanford? 
What would you study at Stanford? Signing. <laughs> All right. You've got the education we're looking for. There you go. Uh, worked for f- 10 years for FedEx. Wow. How'd that go? How'd you get into that biz? Uh, I got to ring doorbells. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you did it professionally, and then you just got hooked. And what else? It says here you were a pizza maker at Papa John's Pizza. Spun the pizzas. <laughs> I don't want to bring that up right now. I don't want to hurt my chances. Of a future career. Oh, Papa right, no, John's is kind of... We're okay with that. Yeah, he's uh, racist. Yeah. Well, so you want to hire or There's what? no racism in uh, sign language. Well, wh- Oh, what if you're, you're talking about racism on a podcast? Would you sign like bad words? Yes, but we have to put a <laughs> disclaimer. We have oh. to, but we have to, the crazy thing is we have to sign the disclaimer. <laughs> Would you censor it as well? Like block the... <laughs> The signing? Yeah, would you block the signing? You know, like when they bleep a cuss word. Oh, yeah, we, that can happen sometimes. But, have you not thought words. of these things, Delilah? It sounds like this company is still, you know, we're not at so, its feet yet. <laughs> we're a startup. <laughs> Do you have a GoFundMe? No, we're trying to be all self-funded. We, we want to own this thing. We think it's going to be go, lucrative. Go fund yourself. Uh, Tony, talk about yourself. What are your dreams? Where do you want to go to next? Uh, I'm looking to go to L.A., maybe. Back to L.A. to like yeah. shoot some more movies? Uh, well, uh, we shot The Shining in the U.K. <laughs> she seems to have an attitude at our lack of knowledge about The Shining. <laughs> <laughs> or he does. Uh, sorry. You're gen- I'm gender neutral. You're very gender neutral there. Um, I don't have genitals. <laughs> oh, I was going to ask you, do you have like a, a lover? Do you, are you capable of love? I was talking to a pinky for a little <laughs> while, but... Kind of faded out, you know. Get it, Tony? No, let's 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 help you out here. I think we can help Tony out because, like, you're an attractive finger, you uh, know. Thanks. We yeah. are two fully qualified sex birds. Yeah, so let's let's kind of uh, help you out here. So, for those, uh, uh, are you looking for another finger? I, I'm down to get with some fingers or you know? the hot finger. Uh, on finger I've been action. talking to toes occasionally <laughs> on Grinder. <laughs> Wait, toes can be slutty. <laughs> Exactly. Sometimes you gotta get one and be gone. They get out of a sock for one second and they're fucking anything uh, they find. I do know that if a toe has a ring, she will suck your dick. <laughs> Did you learn that in uh, certified professional midwife school? I'm a sex expert, Delilah. I just know these things. I just know it. Um, I think that made sense, though, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. I, audience, I hope you wrote that down. <laughs> Oh, oh, which reminds me, our topic of the day, which is uh, post-AOL cybersexing. Because um, the thing is, I did a lot of cybersexing during the AOL oh, wait, days, wait, but wait, that was wait, 56K. Wait, hold on, hold on. Do you yeah. have a cell phone? No, no. I had a, a pager in the 80s. <laughs> How do you communicate with, with people, you know? How do we get in touch with you if we meet a toe that we think yeah. we should send you I away? have an email address. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> um, it's a... Uh, Tony the finger dash red rum uh, underscore one at AOL.com. Oh, AOL. AOL. That reminds me of our topic of the day, which is post AOL cyber sexing. But well, uh, I'm still, I'm still, I'm not post yet. Oh, you're not, you're not post. Is AOL still around? Uh, Does this topic not make sense? We changing it to keep AOL alive? <laughs> <laughs> um, no, let's get back to, I want to, I want to get you hooked up with a, a nice little finger. Okay. Oh. So, um, what? We have fingers listening to us all over the world. Yeah, yeah. What, what would be your ideal like first date? Uh, maybe we go somewhere nice okay. that has like chicken tenders or fries, finger foods. You know. Oh, I got a question. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Will you date a finger that's still attached to the hand? Oh, good, 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 good. Uh. I that, mean, if not, that rules out a lot of fingers. That's a lot of baggage, you know? <laughs> fair enough, They're fair still enough. carrying everything with them, and fair I need enough. something light and free. It's like dating a guy with kids. Yeah. What about, um? would you ever date a monkey paw? Like a magical mon- monkey paw that like could give you winch- wishes? Uh, <laughs> wishes? I mean, yes, for wishes, but also no, because, like, possession. You know, I've been, uh, I'm a possessor. I'm not trying to get possessed. I gotcha. And it, would that be bestiality? Because it is a monkey paw. I think, yeah. If I reflect upon my own personal sex expertise, <laughs> yes. bestiality has to involve genitals. <laughs> oh. oh, so I'm fine. You're fine. Oh, okay, good, good, good. You'll good. still go to heaven. Um, Amen. All monkey paws go to heaven. And um, what, what kind of interest do you have? Because you gotta have a common interest. You know, finger, finger, interest. Mm-hmm. Uh, pointing. <laughs> 
Um, I'm a big movie buff as well. Oh, yeah. Cause, you yeah, know, I got in... to work with Kubrick, so ah. I just kind of watched the rest of those. He didn't cast me in anything else. Why not? Because he's a dick. Well, usually they say, like, once you're in one Kubrick film... You're in oh. others, not not for me. I, no. She seems to have an att- sorry. He seems to have an attitude. <laughs> I'm gender neutral. But our lack of n- movie knowledge <laughs> and lack of Kubrick knowledge. I know. In 2001, Space Odyssey, he did that one. You know, you eyes know, wide. She casted that. the same apes in every Planet of the Apes. <laughs> <laughs> I had to think about that. I was so dumb. <laughs> uh, okay, and- so movies pointing. Um, where would you like to ha- have your wedding? Do you want to get married? You want to get like a long term sort of uh, thing? Or? I mean, I'm an open minded okay. girl guy, you know. <laughs> so I, I don't want anything to like. I want to be able to do you to hop a, around. But do you want to have a family? Do you want to settle down? Oh yeah, okay. that's a sensitive subject for me. Why? I lost my family. Oh my god! So they were the other fingers were your family. Yeah. We so were who born were the, Wait, did one of them go to the market? <laughs> Don't I make light of offensive. her plight. Then one of them go. That's a toe thing. I'm a finger. <laughs> you can play it with the fingers. So you're the pointer finger, right? Uh huh. Okay. So what? Who are the others in your family? The thumb. My mom was the thumb. Okay. My dad was the middle finger. Oh. I was the favorite child. It must have been, <laughs> must have been hard. Uh, the ring finger. The ring finger. Uh, my brother Richie. <laughs> and then uh, the runt of our litter, the preemie, was Pamela. <laughs> preemie Pamela. Preemie Pamela. That the is pinky. It's like the ja- y'all are like the Jackson Five of fingers. So I don't want <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the Jackson Five of fingers. Except my dad was not abusive. <laughs> oh well, I was going to ask you because, like, you know, it, it sounds rough because he was a middle finger. Was he like a really like you know fuck off kind of guy or sweetheart? Super calm. Really, super calm? He was yeah. a little sweetheart? Uh, Never cussed. I religious thought you just gave guy. us a new sex sports topic. Super calm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, oh, speaking of topic of the day, uh, I want to get to our topic of the day, which is um, post-AOL cyber sexing. And you know, you talk yeah. a lot about AOL, but what about those other, you know, what about Yahoo Messenger? Yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, I, I only use AOL. What Earthlink, about Facebook I, Messenger. Now we used to have a Sexperts uh, official website at Angel Fire. In fact, some of our uh, stuff is still on there. Yeah, you know, tons of knowledge we've dropped on there. Do you think it's still up there? Let's go. Let's, let's look. Go. Let's look at. It. Do you have www dot dot sexperts dot angelfire dot com. <laughs> Oh, it's still Oops. up there. Ooh, that's I didn't remember that picture. Yeah, uh, there's a gif of hanging with Mr. Cooper for some reason. I'm not sure who put that up there. I guess I was into hanging with Mr. Cooper. I don't know. <laughs> and Screech going, <laughs> did I do that? <laughs> Screech's thought bubble. Did I do her? <laughs> um. So, oh, you were inside. You were <laughs> you were inside the the phone party. That, how is it going in there? You said people are not going to make it. Oh, uh, there's rum everywhere. It's bad people are tripping on the foam on the alcoholic beverages over each other who do you call for a foam problem is that a fireman <laughs> thing foam busters yeah, foam busters <laughs> I, i'd say they do they like with their their fire hydrants they have foam too so i think that would be a bad person to call God, foam maybe foam. like a, a kitty f- litter can't fight thing. foam with foam is that what you're saying no <laughs> you know a lot about movies and foam fighting <laughs> Look at my resume a little bit closer. <laughs> oh, there, you didn't flip it over. There's a back to it. Oh, uh, yeah. it's all foam. <laughs> <laughs> the foam years. <laughs> Wait, did you cause the foam problem? I plead the fifth. Oh, uh, my, I need a this lawyer is not a court, available before. This is a podcast, not a court of law. <laughs> Tony, Tony, Tony. I was about to say, Tony the Finger. Tony, Tony, Tony is my favorite group. <laughs> <laughs> Tony the Finger sounds like a, a mob boss. Have you ever been involved with the mafia? Mafia? Uh, I mean, I've seen a couple of mob films. Oh, but you've never been involved. Scarfinger. <laughs> <laughs> Scarfinger. Where'd you get that scar on you? What, what is that? Where'd uh, you get that from? Good fingers. <laughs> Actually, uh... When Harry plucked Sally. <laughs> that doesn't have the word finger in it. Plucked. <laughs> Where'd you get the scar from? I actually had, uh... You know, those little pieces of skin you just start peeling? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. You peel a little too much. Oh, a little too far. It's like a <laughs> circumcision for us. Favorite Adam Sandler movie? The Wedding Finger. <laughs> 
you should do comedy. These are pretty good. <laughs> oh, no. I, I saw him do stand-up. He's awful. Um, so let's get to our topic of the day, which is post-AOL cybersexing. And, uh, oh, uh, they're opening up the doors, and foam is coming out. Oh, God. Oh. We're, not, we're not even going to have time to dial up now. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Listen, um, we're going to go inside. If you want to join us for this foam party, you know, go for it. But uh, it looks like you're all foamed out. You're getting a little too pruney. Hey, I have no grip at all. <laughs> Uh, we didn't even get to talk about Jack. We uh, uh, Jack Nicholson. Okay, <laughs> God, he's okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's all you need. Um, all right. Well, uh, Does he know how to treat a finger. Please come back in the show. A little too well. <laughs> HR problems. <laughs> please come back in the show, and and maybe we'll find you a, a perfect match. Perfect match. Yeah. Matchmaker, matchmaker, mm-hmm. give me a match. Mm-hmm. The sheer Johnny, <laughs> you know. Okay, uh, so that's it for the experts. Uh, any other last minute pieces of advice, words of wisdom, anything we want to plug? Um, plug like a hole in a dam. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're getting a little offensive here. You Sorry, know, finger fun. kind. I'm a little hurt. You keep misgendering <laughs> me. Um, I'd like to plug yeah. red rum, um, and also part of my my working with. Uh, What's the rum I work for? Oh, uh, Captain Morgan. Captain yeah. Morgan. Oh, I'm definitely getting fired. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Drink Captain Morgan. Red rum, red rum. Uh, the Shining is now streaming on Netflix, so I still get money for each view. Oh, great. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. well, that's it for the experts. I'm your host, Dr. John T. Alanese, CPM. And I'm Delilah Haydair, and if you'd like to sign for a podcast, please send me a video of yourself signing this podcast. Sign, sealed podcast, I'm yours. Sign, signs, everywhere people are signing podcasts. (laughs) See you next time. Bye. That's our show. If you like what you heard and you think it was worth a dollar, join the official Sexperts fan club at patreon.com backslash sexperts podcast. A special thanks to the Push Comedy Theater and all of our supporters. Bye-bye.